Despite what some people may think, trademarks and copyrights are not the same thing. Trademarks can essentially last forever and cover things like company names, logos, slogans, things of that nature. Copyrights um, cover the arts, like music, books, architecture, paintings, things of that nature. And depending on who created the works determines how long the copyright lasts. If it was an individual, it's life plus 70 years. If it's a corporation, it's either 120 years from the date of creation or 95 years from the date of publication. And once something enters the public domain, it never comes back. And the reason why there's a um, date of expiration for copyrights is basically to promote progress and to let um, people have an easier access to thing to these works without paying like a bunch of huge fees. And two works that are in the public domain are various Christmas songs and plays by Shakespeare, which for both examples, I think it's a good thing that they're in there. Um, Christmas songs get you in the mood. It's they play it all month long, and it's just something you come to expect to hear. And plays by Shakespeare are used by English classes as a teaching tool, and it's always nice to learn about a time period other than your own. And two pieces of work that are still protected by copyright are the images of the Peanuts gang created by Charles Schultz and the music from the musical The Sound of Music. And I think it's good that at least for now that they're still protected by copyright because with at least the, the music from The Sound of Music, it's based off real life and it's nice to dictate something that personal, where it goes and what it's used for. And with the Peanuts gang, it, something that's been in American culture for so long, it's nice that, it, for, at least for now, it's not portrayed in a negative light.